Sunday najua umekuwa ukingoja sana after service kujua tumeenda nini so today it has been about uh, Bible study exposition and um, on pressing on so we have been uh, taken through the scriptures and just to get what is about knowing the bible and just getting to study it on your own so with us here we have the preacher of the day and would want to learn from her and also just to tell us what has been outstanding and why she chose to to give us this topic and how it has been for her so we will invite her uh, as kabado tunamgoja unaweza ngoja ngoja tu kidogo uh, even as we ask some other question we can have mine yes we can have uh, mine here anaweza tuambia ame learn nini what has been outstanding for her ndio hadi pia nyinyi mziwe si ndio so mine hi what has been outstanding for you kwa hii service uh, so amine uh, and what has been outstanding for me today is um about living a life with a, with an attitude of Paul like how Paul would live his life focusing on cli- on Christ despite his life like when he alikuwa ameishi life like it was a bad life but he will say that that means nothing to him and he will focus on living a great life and focusing on Christ and he will say like dying yenye many outstandia sana ni venye alisema that dying it is more it is what i see better than at a living here with you because dying it will make me go to christ yeah that is thank you so much amesema paul amesema a nini what has been outstanding for her ni life ya paul venye paul alikuwa transformed na venye paul alikuwa into so uh, obeying the lord and also just doing what the uh, the lord required of him so hiyo imekuwa amazing sana we thank the lord for that also for me uh, what has been outstanding is the fact that i'm supposed to live a prayerful life so we have the preacher of the day with us here we'll invite her just to tell us uh, how she is and also uh, what has been outstanding for her today hi so i uh, would we'll want you to tell us maybe uh, what has been outstanding and also for the person that did not manage to attend the service what would you tell them maybe on a uh, bible study exposition uh, thank you so i think today minister and i, I think through throughout this sermon it's first the, the need of understanding paul's message to the philippian church he had to write that message possible for him maybe to wait until he was out of prison for him to write the letter but this that is coming is a voice of a very concerned and a concerned father i'm having planted this church he is showing his affection towards it and also his devotion towards the growth of the church urging them to be able to lead even to have bread even in suffering and to watch out even for those who are teaching the wrong thing so i think the good for me as a person is of his former life and comparing it to what he was at that time the point of counting his life uh, his former life as all loss for the sake of christ and his ambition was for him to know god i i mean the paul that I have read about in the book of acts and from the other epistles romans corinthians uh, the galatians no christ and suffering to share in his death you know that i may gain or attain the resurrection from the that is also for me because having walked with christ having known christ and still he desires to know christ and to like to be able to share in his suffering that he may attain the price and even to attain resurrection that for me is profound and i think the call could be for all of us as christians the the point of uh, letting paul and having joy in suffering and gearing towards uh, counting everything that we have lost or everything that we had before as lost for the sake of gaining christ and also just being able in all that we do to be able to know christ nobody has known christ to the point that you cannot know him again so to just is to know him the power of his suffering to share in that suffering to know the power of his resurrection and also to share in his death that we may attain joy pressing 
kuat Thank you so much. We are so happy and we are humbled to have you uh, today as we sit to you and also we welcome you again. Thank you so much. This commission conference. Yeah, commission conference is a missions mobilization and training conference that is coming. so much. Uh, on that also, I get to thank the Honorable Helen Bosch. So thank you so much, dear brother. So uh, yes, you're saying next year, so um, you can really enter into the full ministry and be uh, that kind of helper and then be part of the ministry and then be a good one and go there. So let's see, I think our commission team is going to see next year. Can you remind us who are that? Yes, Pastor Yuri. Together.